FIFA 19 is finally here, and if you want any cheap MSP or PSN for FIFA points or some cheap game codes, check out G2A.com. I'll leave a link down below in the top line of the description and use code HABER for 3% cash back. How's it going, lads? Before we get into the video, I just wanted to quickly say that I'm going to be opening a few gold uh, upgrade packs just in the background whilst we talk about the things that I want to talk about. So recently, well, last night actually, PlayStation users that have the game early, whether they got the game through a seller that just sold them the game uh, or a store, or whether they got lucky and just got sent the game early, I'm not entirely sure how they got the game, and PC players that also have the uh, full game early, got their UCL or UEFA Champions League player pick packs early. And I wanted to talk about some of the pools that they got. I wanted to talk about the UEFA Champions League player picks. I don't want to talk about all that good stuff. If you do go on to enjoy this video, a like would be greatly appreciated. Subscribe to my channel. We're trying to get to 50k subs as quickly as possible. I am grinding the uploads out right now, trying to get to 50k. So if you guys do go on to enjoy the video, uh, a subscription also would be greatly appreciated. It goes a long way and just helps out the journey to 50k. Now, I actually have a bunch of different photos here of the uh, of the uh, the UCL player picks. Uh, some of them have the full picks. Some of them just have the players that they picked. And I wanted to talk about them. And in the background, because I had nothing else really to put in the background, I wanted to go ahead and put some of these two player packs in the background. So uh, let's pull up some of these uh, some of these uh, pictures of player picks as we get ourselves a uh, Cal Hanoglu in a two player pack, which isn't fantastic. But going into these uh, pictures and these two player pack pictures, not two player pack pictures, sorry, these are. Uh, these uh, UCL player pick pictures. The first one I've got here is actually a Robertson. Now, Robertson looks really, really good. And uh, and I will show you guys the full list after I've opened these packs and talked to you guys about the uh, about the pictures. I will show you the guys the full list of the players you guys can get in just a second. Um, but we have Robertson there, which actually seems really, really decent. Looks like a sick card. And, uh, and it's only 80 to 83 rated players. So Martial got UCL player pick card, or UCL Champions League card, sorry. Uh, but won't be the player pick because his Champions League card is 80 or so I'm aware. I don't think it's the base card rating. Uh, the next one we have here is a Lozano. Someone got a Lozano, which I think is really, really cool. A great, great card. A great looking card, should I say, uh, in Lozano. And I thought that was a really, really lucky pick. And by the way, if you see the Xbox controls, uh, it actually is just uh, it's PC with an Xbox controller. Um, it's not an Xbox that people have got them on. Uh, the next one I've got here is actually on the uh, on the phone app. Someone got two of them and a Jim Hunter. Now, I'm wondering how they got two. Maybe they got double the rewards. I know that if you buy a hard copy of the Champions Champions Edition or the Ultimate Edition, and you get the uh, you buy online the Ultimate Edition or the Champions Edition, you get two times the rewards. Um, so maybe that's what this guy has done. Uh, but I thought that was a uh, that was an interesting one to share with you guys. He got Candreva and Phillips, so. Uh, that's super interesting. And why I think that uh, it isn't the base card ratings because Philip is 80 rated and he got one in the uh, in the player pick pack. Now, uh, the next one we've got here is someone got a James Milner. I think that's a great pull. I've got this coming on my Road to Glory account and I'm not entirely sure what I want from it. But uh, someone like a James Milner will probably go a really long way in uh, in the Road to Glory. So uh, we're not, we had to get a ball drop right now. We've got Ben Davies, I think. I think that's his name. Um... But that's a decent pull in my opinion. I think that was actually a sick pull. Now, this is what a full one looks like. And I think this one looks pretty good. This guy got a... a sorry, this one looks pretty bad even. But uh, but the, the 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 picture of it looks pretty good. So he's got like a Jean Mario, Belind, Maicon, Marcos Laurent, uh, uh, and Denisov. Uh, or Marcos Laurent, should I say. Or Llorente. I don't know how to say that properly. Um, and we get to get a walkout in any of these. I know I'm not expecting the one from five. But a board drop would be nice at least as we get... Who's this? Danny Rose? Danny Rose. He's actually one that you could get. I think Nep got him in his. Um, but that's what they look like. I think this guy actually picked um, Jean Mario because who wouldn't? And then here's another one. Now, this guy got Lalana Herrera and Mike on Matip Carnages. I would personally go for Lalana, but they don't look fantastic. I think you have to get super lucky to get a really good player in. And like I said, I've got the full list and I will go through it. But I want to hear your opinion. Who do you guys think would be the best one to get? Uh, now, the next one here we have actually got is the last one. It's actually somebody called Abe FIFA. Now, I actually know FIFA Abe. He's a pro player and a really, really good player. He got Dembele in his, which I thought was super lucky. There's a screenshot uh, of his tweet out. Um, but uh, but FIFA got, got Dembele, which I thought was a super lucky pick. Uh, and that's the best one I've seen so far as we get five non-boards in a row. And uh, and that's just super unfortunate and super unlucky. But I wanted to talk to you guys more about the full list on uh, on Foothead. And uh, and we're going to jump into that in just a second. Now, here's the full list of all the Champions uh, Champions League cards. Now, if we scroll down and we start at 80 here, uh, Kalinic is the first uh, pick that like the, the lowest rated or all, all the 80s here. Uh, so these are all the lowest picks you can get. Now, if I'm looking at all these cards, cards that I would personally want in my player pick, 
Pulisic would be a decent one. Neres has five-star skills. He'd be a decent one. Globin or Globin's a decent one as well. Uh, Lindelof is also a pretty decent one. If we turn the page here, we have the likes of Philip that we saw in one of them. We have the likes of, uh, uh, looking at the good ones, Gaia looks pretty decent. If you ask me, Denis Suarez looks okay as well. Kazawa looks pretty decent. Uh, Connor Poyanka looks pretty decent as well. But uh, but personally, the the kind of ones that I would want are maybe Premier League ones. I probably if I if I had the only Premier League option was either Mignolet or Brava, I'd probably take them. Nelson Semedo seems like a really solid uh, option as well. I'm looking forward to my options too. I want to see who I get. Emre Chan looks like a pretty sick option as well. So uh, these are all really solid options. But these are all the ones that are you know possible to get. As we move on to the next page, we have the likes of Marcus Rojo, Sedibe, Oxlade Chamberlain, uh, Jones, Delph, uh, Jagoev, Mwanyama, Klein, Sturridge looks all right as well. Young looks all right. You know, there's a few decent pulls. Cancelo would be a great one, in my opinion. Rashford would be fantastic as well. Oreo would be fantastic. Robertson, in my opinion, is one of the best ones to get. Robertson and, and Mendy look like the two best ones to get, though, in my opinion. On a road to glory anyway, and a pack-only road to glory, because... Uh, I don't know. It just seems it just seems way more worth it to get either of these two. Um, with with how hard it seems to be to pack good left backs and right backs, so they look really decent as well. As we turn the page, we get the likes of Shakiri, Matip, uh, Smalling looks okay as well. Smalling looks pretty decent. Alana, Piszczek. It sucks that we miss out on all the 83s. Um, for example, uh, like Martial's base 83, but his Champions League's an 84. But as we move down, Fred would be amazing. I think Fred's one of my most wanted ones. Fred's and Lucas looks really good. Bailly looks fantastic. Uh, Arthur looks okay. Dembele looks fantastic. Linglet, uh, Lenglet, sorry, looks all right. Lingard looks pretty decent. Florenzi, Amunia, Party, Rugani, Bernadeschi, Nabri, all look like solid, solid picks. Uh, Allen looks fantastic. Herrera looks really, really good. Tyson and Zonzi, Marlos, Trippier, Toprak. Henderson, Wijnaldum, uh, Valencia would be an amazing one to get in my opinion as well. And then sadly we move on to the 84s. Now all of these guys aren't available. I thought there would be as well, which sucks, but sadly they're not. It's all of these guys above that are available. But um, if I was to pick any of them, honestly, I'd probably go with like the likes of someone. I'd probably go with a midfielder or a defender, honestly. I don't think I'd go with an attacker. I think that uh, there's not enough amazing attackers with these to actually warrant going for an attacker. But they still look pretty sick, and it's great that we're getting these for free. You get to, you get to keep the, the card for free for the rest of the game. It's untradeable, and uh, I don't know if it's dynamic or not. I don't know if it's like a one to watch or a path to glory where it gets updated. I think these are probably my most wanted ones. If I was to pick any of these guys, it'd probably be one of these dudes. Uh, they all look fantastic. They all look like great, great cards. So it'd probably be one of these guys that I'd pick. Uh, definitely. Now, I think that for sure it's going to be the rating of the blue card. And the reason I think that is because if we look at someone like Phillips, for example, the guy from uh, from Dortmund, um, is it? F it's 1L, isn't it? I think it's 1L. There he is. Maximum, ma Max, Max. I'm just going to call him Max. Maximilian. Max Philip. Uh, this guy's Champions League card is an 80 rated. However, his base card is 79 rated. And you can get him in the 80 to 83. So it definitely does not go on their base card. It goes on their, it goes on their Champions League card, which I think is pretty interesting. Uh, I think that's actually a better way to do it as well because... Um, you know, it gives it gives options for decent 79 rated, like for for the likes of uh, Connor Playanka, who uh, who's a 79 rated. But this card would be a great card to get. I think it definitely gives it a bit more of a dynamic. It definitely makes it a little bit better to get as well. So I'd, I'd say definitely for one of these guys or all of these guys would be the better option of all of them. So uh, I think that uh, for sure, my, my uh, truthfully, my most wanted one is Fred. I, I think Fred's my most wanted one. Uh, I really like this card in Ultimate Team. I like his 82 rated, so his 83 rated would probably be fantastic. And I do hope that it goes up with uh, Champions League performances. Maybe Fred won't get an upgrade if it does. However, the likes of other players will. So that's pretty exciting. I'm, I'm looking forward to that. So hopefully you guys do go to enjoy this video. If you did, leave a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new around here. I really appreciate all the support recently. You guys have been smashing it. In fact, if we go and look at something like, uh, if we go and look at uh, my social blade, for example, 300 subs gained today, 41,000 views already today. That's unbelievable. And I'm very, very, very grateful for it. Like if we look at numbers I was getting like last week compared to right now, the channel is doing amazingly right now. And I'm very, very, very much appreciated. So thank you all for support recently. If you do enjoy this video, leave a like, subscribe if you guys are new around here and I'll see you later. later.